Satellite imagery appears to show North Korea getting ready to put on a military parade, likely for the anniversary next Monday of the founding of its military. Often the regime uses these parades to show off new strategic weapons. Han Sung-woo has this report. North Korea, ahead of Monday's 90th anniversary of the founding of its People's Revolutionary Army, appears to be preparing for a large-scale military parade. Radio Free Asia reports that more than 12,000 troops gathered on Sunday at the parade training grounds at Medium Airfield in eastern Pyongyang, citing satellite imagery provided by U.S.-based Planet Labs. The pictures showed the troops marching in formation along with scores of vehicles. The day after, 22 fighter jets and 11 helicopters were seen lined up near one of Sunan International Airport's main runways, likely to be flown over Pyongyang as part of the parade. And based on pictures from Sunday and Monday, there were crowds of people not described as military at Kim Il-sung Square, which is where the parade, if held, will take place on or around April 25th. This would appear to indicate that preparations are in their final stage. Voice of America describes the people in the square as holding red flowers and making formations. South Korea's military and intelligence officials are not ruling out the possibility of the parade being held at night. One informed source said Monday that North Korea can mobilize as many as 20,000 troops and a range of military equipment, including armored vehicles and transporter erector launchers used to fire missiles. The source noted the regime could even showcase its intercontinental and submarine-launched ballistic missiles. This came as the United States stationed the USS Alexandria, an attack submarine, in Yokosuka, Japan on Monday, not long after the USS Abraham Lincoln Carrier Strike Group conducted a naval exercise in the East Sea with Japan last week, amid growing concerns of North Korean provocations. Han Sung-woo, Arirang News.